Christian Wilson. All right. He is one of the coaches from the first team to work in Manchester City. Now he works for, with Patrick. Good guy, he's gonna be working with us tonight. Do you know what makes the goal? So I've just watched all them clips, I think it was eight, nine clips. Do you know what makes it? So the guy on the ball, what helps me make a better decision? So I've got the ball on my feet, now I'm going towards the goal there. What's going to help me? The position of the defenders, yeah. So I've got the ball on my feet, I'm looking at the position of the defenders, but from an attacking point of view, take, it, take yourself out of the, um, the equation of defending, think attacking, think attack-minded things. Yes. Of your ah, okay, correct. That's all I'm looking for. Okay, so movement creates space, space creates opportunities, and opportunities create goals. By making the pitch big, what does it make it very difficult for the defenders to do? Yeah, it's really hard because if they're really wide and we're told to keep compact, if you're spreading the pitch and making it as big as possible out there, it's going to make it really difficult. Who's ever used an umbrella? You ever used an umbrella? Okay, so what I think about when I'm attacking is I think for an umbrella. So when I open an umbrella, what does it do? It correct. It spreads out, it fans out, it makes it big. Okay, but then if I think I want to go defensive, what do I do with the umbrella? When the sun comes out, I pull it in, it becomes tight and compact again. So that's what I need you to think about. When you're attacking, make the pitch big, umbrella, boom, make it big. When I don't, pull the umbrella in, make it tight, it'll be really difficult to defend against. Okay, so they're the things that I need you to be mindful of when you go outside. Okay, make sure you have a big smile, a lot of fun. Okay, I'll see you outside. Half of you in that white, and I just want you to start moving the ball around so I can take a little look at your footwork with the ball. So just move around with the ball. You don't have to do anything too dynamic, too quick. I just want you to manipulate the ball and move it around. Close your eyes. Look left. Look right. Look up. Close your eyes. And stop. Well done. Perfect. That's all I'm looking for. So you're feeling the ball. Ready? Everyone start toe tapping. Listen to my voice. Mine's just the commands that have been sent out there, just little signal. Look up, close your eyes, start moving the ball again, off you go, move the ball again, move the ball. Little bit quicker now, little bit quicker on your movements. Good, I like it. Keep moving it around, keep moving it around, keep moving it around, it's good stuff. Good. Find your partner. Mike's going to catch my ball, I'm going to catch his ball. Watch, off you go. Catch. Come on, catch. Catch, catch, move it, catch, good, move it, good, catch, catch. Okay, stop, fantastic. So his feet never get set. I don't want to see the heels touch the floor. You're constantly working off the balls of your feet, reacting to whatever's coming, okay? You got that? If I catch you not smiling, you'll do 10 laps of the pitch. Ready? Go! Off you go. Multitasking, mind's working. Medium signal, head to hand. Keep it going, keep working it. Good, I like it. That's it. Okay, ball on the floor, start moving it again. Getting warm, well done. Oh, I need to test it. Put your hands around your head now. Ready, it's not done yet. Ready, off you go. Oh, you see, not as easy as when I'm doing it. Are you awake? Anybody in there? Okay, start again, ready? Yes! Well done! Better! Off you go! There you go. Got to react quick. Got to work off your toes. Got to react quick. Okay. Next one in. You drop it. Next one drops out. Three, two, one. Off you go. Quick feet. Quick feet. Okay. So if we put ten balls there, ten over there, ten here. Just a basic rondo. Last one on the knee goes in. Good, you and your mate. In you go. Are you ready? One, so, touch. one or two touch. One or two touch on the outside. It's a nice big area for you. Ready? Go. All off one now, if you can. Oh, in you go. You don't have to just go get the ball back though. Go. Nice and quick. Go. Keep him in there. Keep him in. Keep him in. Get that one. 
Good, use the outside. Use the outside. Use the outside. Ready, 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 go. Well done, Rowan. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Ready, 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 go, go, go. Well done. Very good. This one. Go. Ba. Very good. One more. Go. Go. Ready? Fight. Ready? Two. Well done. One more. Good, good, good. good energy, guys. Good. Keep the ball moving. There we go. Now what you got? Now what have you got? Where's his run? Come on, then. Fill in those areas. Well done, Nine, for getting across the front poles. Yes, Keeper. Nine. Sometimes you can penetrate and sometimes you need to build. Okay, I know it's a little bit difficult delivering from the wide areas because it's quite a long way to try and get across in there. But the principles are still the same, whether it's a big pitch or a small pitch. The principles will always remain the same. Okay, really well done. How many goals did we score? Three. We scored three? Two. Scored how many? So maybe the crowd might not pay to come back again because we didn't <laughs> score enough goals. Okay, so and that's what it's all about. We're talking about create, being creative. Creation is it through combination? Is it someone through 1v1 situations? Okay, but what's really important is your positioning on the pitch because without the wide players playing wide, there is no width. So you need to be really mindful when you're playing collective and you're playing together. Okay, well done.